Right now, only on 12 News, the owner of a popular downtown Phoenix restaurant opening up to the 12 News I team before surrendering for prison this morning. The I team's Erica Stapleton has been covering this federal fraud case for more than two years. And Erica, we want to warn our viewers that some of the language in this report is explicit. Yeah, Tram, it's explicit because of the restaurant's name. We are talking about Breakfast Bitch on Roosevelt Row, and owner Tracy Hatsona agreed to do an interview with me on her last day of freedom for now. What are you feeling today? Mixed emotions, as you might imagine. Tough to leave, obviously, my family and my staff and Breakfast Bitch. I feel a lot of remorse. Breakfast Bitch owner Tracy Hatsona heading to prison after taking a plea deal for wire fraud admitting in federal court that she took money from actress Jumana Kidd, NBA star Jason Kidd's ex-wife. Kidd's team said Hudsona stole more than a million dollars in funds before she opened up her restaurants in San Diego and Phoenix. Hudsona was arrested in 2021, about two years after she stopped working for Kidd. I knew that in the back of my mind this was out there. You know, I knew that. I absolutely didn't think that it would play out like this. Do you ever think about why you did what you did? That's what I'm really looking forward to the most about going in. I feel like there are so many new programs. And I'm going to the women's camp, and they have a lot of different programs there that I feel like I really want to make the most of and, and find out why. If you want to hear more from Tracy Hetzona or what her prison sentence means for the restaurant, we'll have more of her interview tonight on 12 News at 6. And I did confirm with the Bureau of Prisons that as of this morning, Hetzona is in federal custody. We're in the studio. Erica Stapleton, 12 News.